Yeah. Yeah, that happened. Um, before I lose my bleep, a few notes. If you happen to have the pleasure of seeing me about to have a breakdown, meltdown, um, if you hear my voice, if you see this really pissed off, fat face, subscribe to the channel because um, there might be a lot more videos like this. Also, on a positive note, um, before I go into a full rage, it is my son's 13th birthday today. It was his bar mitzvah today. That got ruined. Thanks, Canes. But if you could do me a favor, one of his uh, TikTok videos just went berserk uh, viral all over the world. Way more than we're up to probably 150,000 views at this point. So go follow my son on TikTok at Zach, Z-A-C-H, randomizing things. Zach randomizing things. Um, he's awesome at what he does. And he deserves, he deserves the follow. He deserves everything. He had a great birthday, a great bar mitzvah. He did a great job. He's a great kid. He's awesome. And um, he probably should be coaching the Canes defense. Let's get the bleep into this. I've been watching Miami Hurricanes football since I was a wee tyke back in the 70s, early 80s. I've, we, we, we've all witnessed a lot of bleeping games. Just games that make you want to vomit. I have never, I think the record books will show this, I have never seen a worse goddamn defensive performance in my freaking life. What the hell was that? You gave up almost 800 god freaking dang yards. Not one. Two running backs over 200 yards. One of them over 300 yards. Almost 600 yards on the ground you gave up. That is a bunch of horse bleeping manure. I'm trying not to swear because maybe there's a kid within seven miles of your house and I don't want that kid to be scared out of their mind. It's my alma mater. I love the University of Miami more than anything. Win, lose, or draw. I went through five and six seasons. I went through losses to FIU and Louisiana Tech and shutouts up at Doe Campbell. I, I've been through it all. Clinton Portis fumbling a bunch of times at East Carolina. Uh, Kenny Kelly getting his leg broken off at Virginia Tech. I've been through horrible losses. I... and I Listen, we went through the game together where Al Golden got his ass fired... After losing to Clemson, we went through it together when the Canes got blanked by Virginia to close out the, the Orange Bowl. I have never witnessed shit like that. Pardon my French. I'm not the fire people type of guy. I'm not. But not one of those defensive coaches deserves to bleep in return. You want to give Manny another year? Fine. You know what? They only lost two games this year. Granted, it was the two games against the only good opponents on the schedule, but that's oh freaking K. You know what? Here's what I'm pissed off about, okay? Because I have a bag of goodies in the car. I'm just sitting in the parking lot of my development in the car because I can't be around my family right now. I can't be around my family. Uh, they're watching their Gators who are going to blow the crap out of LSU. Maybe they won't, but they're in a lot better mood than I am. So I literally just got in the car. I walked out of the house, did not say a damn word, got in the car, and I'm just parked in a random parking lot in my development. 
because I couldn't stand to be home. I couldn't, I just could not do it. I had to get out. Normally, games like this, I drink the Pepto-Bismol, right? I drink a shitload of this. But you know what? This is not freaking good enough for how bad I feel. The hell out of here with that. Oh, I don't know. How about this? Maybe I should just crap out this loss. Just drink this. Go a little pure lax and just have the liquid squirt for hours trying to get that crap out of me. No, that ain't good enough. Maybe we should go pill route. Pill route. Got a little uh, Xanax here. It's a prescription. So it's, uh, it's legal because I, I have a prescription for it. Xanax? No, no. Dosage ain't good enough. Maybe we go a little bit harder. Clonopin? I got the prescription for that. I don't think that'll do it. Plus, I'm in the car driving, and it's just going to make me sleepy. How about some uppers? Do we go uppers? Prozac? I got the prescription for that. No. Take too long to work. That won't do anything right now. What else do I got? Oh, we got the Lexapro. We got a real strong dosage of the Lexapro. Also, prescription. All of these drugs are mine in name via legal prescription. Uh, so don't try them at home. Um, there might be some mental health issues, especially after watching this Canes team. The Lexapro, that's not strong enough. I literally, I have a freaking CVS and a Walgreens in my bathroom. I don't have anything that is strong enough to help me with the pain. Now you're saying to yourself, all right, beast, well, go buy something uh, that is grown in the ground and smoke a little of that. That ain't strong enough. And you know what? Let's be honest here. Fat people and, and coke don't do well. So that's out of the question. See Chris Farley. There is nothing on this damn planet that can make me feel any better after that ass ripping. What the hell was that? I want every coach on the defensive side of the ball fired. Do you understand me? It's unacceptable. You got your ass beat by FIU last year in Louisiana Tech, and now you get your ass handed to you by North Carolina. They're not even great, but they had two running backs that look like the next coming of Heisman winners run all up in your... I can't. I can't. I can't. I just can't. Thank God. Uh, listen, I was pissed off there was no Georgia Tech game this week, next week. But thank God for that. Just closer to this firing somebody. And I swear, if Blake James does not make any kind of a move and fire somebody's ass, hmm. As an alum, as somebody who's still trying to pay back their loans to go to that school, who loves every aspect of that damn school, I love it more than anything. It's like a member of my family. I sing the damn alma mater in the shower. And this football team is supposed to represent me? Hell no. The bleep out of here. I can't. I freaking can't anymore. I can't with this damn team and this defense. I'm out.